In this video, I'm showing you how to take a screenshot on Windows 10. If you're new to the channel, please go down below and hit that subscribe button. And once you have subscribed, please go and leave a like as well. So I do hope you found this video useful. I'm showing you a quick guide and showing you two separate methods of taking a screenshot on your computer. So without any further ado, let's go and get into this. So I'm showing you two separate methods within this video. So one of them is going to be using keys on your keyboard to activate it and the other is simply going and finding the application. So let's get into the first method. So what we want to do is simply come down to the search icon on Windows just down here and simply go and type in snipping tool just like so and then click, click on it and then it's going to go and launch this page here. So what we want to do is simply go and click new and then you can go and draw whatever you like. So if you want to draw on here and then minimize it itself, there you go, you then got that image. So if you want to go and add drawings to it, you can click on a pen and you can draw stuff on it um, and you can change the color by pressing on this downward arrow here. And then if you want to go and say copy or save it, you could right click on it and click copy or save as um, or send to. So honestly, copy and save as the main ones. And that's literally it. Um, you can also go and use file as well. Um, but that is the first method done. So honestly, it's really easy, but there is an even easier way. So the easier way is actually going and quit off this here. All you need to do is simply go and press shift windows key and s i'll put that on the screen as well so shift windows key and s and then you get this um it sort of makes the screen darker and you get this option up here it may not be on the screen recorder so draw what you'd like and then just simply go and release and once you then take it you may get a pop-up in the bottom right and it may slide across you can go and click on it and you can open it up but you don't actually need to once you go and release it it's automatically copied to your clipboard so then if i say open up wordpad i can click on it and then go Control v to paste it that's in the picture I took guys that is the second method and it is so so easy and there are two ways to go and take screenshots if you found this video useful please go down below and hit that subscribe button and go and leave a like have an awesome day and I'll catch you in the next one peace